All right, so the next thing we're gonna talk about is um, scrapping damaged goods. Um, so the process that I'm gonna show you is gonna eliminate multiple steps to adjusting damaged merchandise out of inventory. Um, so when you do like a, a, a return and point of sale, if you do it this way, it's going to refund the customer um, and but not return the items back in inventory and instead instead uh, adjust the inventory for scrap. Um, without this, there would be a two-step process because it would return the items into inventory if you did a standard return, um, but then you'd have to go in and do an adjustment. All right, to start, we're going to go to, um, uh, let me see, we're gonna go to adjust reason codes to scrap. Um, so we're gonna go into setup and then inventory. And then we wanna go to our adjustment codes here. And we want to uh, set up, oh, I went to the wrong place, sorry. Adjustment codes, where are you? Let's try that again. So set up inventory. And oh, it was right beside it. <laughs> Sorry. Phew. Okay. So adjustment codes. Thank you, Ryan. <laughs> so you want to make sure that you have an adjustment code for scrap, um, you know, your description, and you want to make sure it goes to the appropriate on um, GL account number. Okay. And then step two is you're going to want to go to um, set up point of sale, and then reason codes. There we go. And then um, now you're going to want to associate your reason codes, your reasons with um, the scrap um, reason code. Okay, so I have my damaged merchandise is associated with scrap. I also have um, a scrap option associated with scrap. Okay, so what this does essentially is when you go and do a return in point of sale, and I'll go to my point of sale again. Um, and I'll go ahead and do a return. And then we'll look for a document. Let's uh, look at um, a customer. Let's do Margaret. Find her tickets. And then I um, can pull this ticket up for a return. And then uh, I'll select this. And as you can see, it's, it's automatically popping in my reason codes. So when I select um, damaged or scrapped, um, the system is gonna automatically do its thing, provide the customer the return, and then um, adjust it um, out of inventory. So it's not gonna go back into inventory. All right, and this is just basically my return receipt. 